What's going on guys? It's your boy Fox back in the house. I know you're sad because you don't see my beautiful face, but it's not that type of discussion today. Today I have two special guests with me. Uh, you two introduce yourselves. What is up guys? I am Mason321 here and we're back here again with the one and only Mr. Fox. Hey, what's going on guys? You're Rich Josh Hammond here and today we're going to be doing this collab with Mr. Fox and uh, my man Fox. If y'all don't know who this man is, this is Super Sky Shaman. He was on a video with Ty, what was it, maybe like a month ago or so? It was um, Seraphina Importance video. Yeah, yeah. About so, a month. Yeah, 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 about a month. Yeah, I heard after I heard that discussion, I was like, I need this man on the, on the discussion. And, you know, <laughs> things worked out today. <laughs> oh, yes. My, uh, what's that called? Um, I was actually on time for once. <laughs> for once. <laughs> but... For once. Guys, if you're wondering what we're talking about, if you haven't read the title, I don't know how you got here, but the title of today is we're discussing John and Serafina's relationship as it stands right now and where it might be, not towards the end of the series, but just where it might end up as the series progresses. Ooh. Uh, what's that called? The host, man. You might as well go first. What are your thoughts, my man? What's your thoughts? Uh, Worst case scenario, I feel like they won't speak to each other anymore, but they'll have a more they'll have a better understanding of one another. Cause you got to understand that. Mm -hmm. You remember when Serafina saw you know the stance Joker was in, and she finally put two and two together, and it showed like all the memories they had together, and it just shattering. That's 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 a big deal, you know, because she's pretty much saying like everything that we've done together up to this point was a lie i don't know what's true were you using me or and all that so you know i'm gonna be honest here it, it's straight up broken i'm i'm one of those ones that's like okay it's broken now go home <laughs> that's me Ooh, ooh, no no that is gone like staking her life up to this point I don't think she really had any real friends in her life. It was more just like colleagues and cooperates and things like that. Yes, people so and all that. Like, yeah. Yeah. All of them. Yes, man. Type foolishness. And so um, the fact that and then John came along and uh, she's like, oh, I actually can trust this guy. He likes me for, uh, he doesn't like me for my power. He likes me for me. And the fact that John was in, uh, influenced like, her entire um her entire like metamorphosis in terms of character as a uh, Ruchan said and um what's that called it's in that q a video hashtag go ahead and uh, watch that video real quick that video was flames but um yoga think... flames oh yes um i think after doing that and him being responsible for that and now having her find out that he had this this ridiculous secret of oh you're busted this entire time like is it is it like, that bad of a like, secret though like to be like in like the grand scheme of the whole thing like yes yes okay. is is that bad <laughs> all right now okay no no so like here's my thing like like you said uh, she is she is gonna be definitely be upset about that and in the, in the worst worst case scenario I I can see happening is that you, we all know that you know she lost her powers and all that and she just found out that john is completely you know op he just wiped the floor with all the royals at the same time <laughs> she she might it, that, that, that still hurts <laughs> yeah it, it's true anywho <laughs> <laughs> she might think be like well since you lied to me from the beginning how do i know that you didn't set me up to get my powers taken away Oh snap! Oh, good That's point. That's very viable. I I remember someone did bring that up, like um, in the when they were at the mall. Yeah. That happened. So you know, and, and, like, yeah. you know, obvious, obvious. Yeah. 
So, you know, obviously, as the readers, we know that 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 is not the case at all. But, you know, she she wouldn't be wrong for thinking like, well, you lied to me about this. And watch that trust you. (laughs) Exactly. But also my thing is. uh, It that like I said, I feel like if worst case, they they might she might come to an understanding. She's like, you know, what? I feel like once they have that sit down and talk moment, because it's going to come. It has to happen, period. I don't know exactly when, but when they have that heart to heart moment, John finally tells her, like, look, I did this because of, you know, point A, B and C, you know, my past, what I've been going through in the present. She can still be like, I understand that. But that 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 line of trust and all that, that that's done. It would break my heart. Trust me. I love I love them both together. It makes me happy. But if she went that route, I wouldn't be upset at her for it. I feel like that's like that's a um, the good story route in a video game. What I'm seeing is what Ty is seeing right now. I'm seeing your follow because you know how women are, Chief. Uh, no yeah. sexual. Ch- <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 No I- sexual, but sticking um, the way like when women are scorned, dude. That hell hath that's, that's no not, fury. Not, yeah. Hell it, hath that, no fury. It, it doesn't work like that, Chief. <laughs> so, um, when I feel like, okay, so the next time she's going to see him, that fool's going to be like, so where were you? Insert the persona music. Dun, 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 oh, my dun, goodness. Dun. And that's what's going to be like. Tension. That was a song that's called Tension. But, Yo. But, can you, I'm, um, I was imagining that scene today. I was like, I said, how are they going to, like, like, she knows now. He doesn't know that she yeah. knows. But I said, well, what is exactly. she going to do? Is she just going to flat out be like, yo, I, I like, cut the, cut the shit. I know you're Joker. Or is she going to try to be like, okay, let me let me try to rationalize this and not yeah. t- and avoid him? I'm, I'm, the, when the, the way that goes down is really going to affect me for the season. I'm not going to stunt. I'm, like, I'm going to be honest here. Like... When when I saw it all go down, I was like, this dude did not plan this. He didn't plan this. And I'm just sitting here just like, if if John is as smart as we think he is, he would have known that Seraphina was bound to find out one way or another. But that's just like me. No, I mean, it's the same thing with like, but th- this is going to be a terrible, this is going to be a terrible reference. I'm probably going to catch so much flack for this, but... You know, Hit, uh, Hitler didn't right. think he was gonna lose the war. Just saying. <laughs> what Hitler? I said Hitler didn't think he was gonna lose the war. I'm just, just saying. Oh, oh my yeah. lord! He didn't think he was, but then his advisors was like, "Yo, we don't have enough stuff, dude." <laughs> <laughs> you know, you know, I'm not trying. I, I don't try to justify anything that he did at all. Just, just for a major clarification, but. It's just a reference. Yeah, but you know, I'm like, I'm pretty sure John thought it out, and it's like, and even then, it's like he thought he thought risking it would still be worth. It. He's like, look, I can get this done quietly. He he knew for a fact he could wash everyone there. He we all knew this. Everybody did. Yeah, and he did. We, we all saw it come. All yeah. of them. He he washed them all. So he's like, if I can get this done quick enough and without her noticing, because you know, for the most part, she didn't care about any of that she's like i'm a cripple now i'm gonna go do cripple things <laughs> which that's doesn't like, involve fighting yeah. <laughs> like there was i think there was like a clean what 10 chapters of just her doing her own thing like she had like the the royals and all the other foolishness was not on her radar yeah like, yeah that fool was literally just living <laughs> and the only re- the only reason she even saw the fight the this fight at the end of the season was because arlo had the foresight enough to be like look holding go go bring her here by any means but she has to see this because he knows how much I- they they've been been around each other she'll be able to see it actually you know? i mean arlo's like god yo it- like the fact that he called that was ridiculous. i mean even if arlo didn't do that she probably was going to find out right like, somewhere later along the line, just not when all the worlds just got. Yeah, she was going to find inevitably before right, the story right. purposes, I, she would have found out. But if, okay, nah, theorize right now. If Holden, if she did, if she wasn't there to like see it, how was she going to find out? Go ahead, pop them at me right now. All right, so later down the line, let's say there at the mall, she actually questions something like that. Like, hey, are you Joker? Like, she gonna drop another question again, like we saw previously. 
y'all ain't going to be all about it. So, you know, someone is going to be bound to say something. And even then, if they weren't going to do that, Arlo probably would have snitched again or Remy or one of the Royals. Yeah, that's what like, I was going to say. I'll, the way I say it is, if if she didn't see the fight, you know, what, how the season ended or whatever, I feel like maybe post-fight when, you know, Arlo, Remy, and all of them are in the hospital, uh, Serafina probably would have gone to visit. Even though she didn't, she was, she didn't really care for, like, Arlo and all that, but she was cool with Blake and Remy. And I don't know about Ice, and I don't think they had a relationship at all. But she's definitely cool with Remy because they're roommates. So she's going to go visit her. Roommates? So, you mean, um, Aren't they friends? roommates? Uh, they're friends. Elaine's a roommate. Oh, okay, my fault. But... She would have went and visit Remy, and I th- I feel like Remy would have been like, "This I don't know I don't know what, what, what this is gonna do." But she like, "Look, John is Joker." Now I feel like Serafina would have been like, "What are you like? No, there's no way. Uh, what are you talking about?" But D- then she sees the damage. <laughs> yeah, and then and then I feel like Remy probably would have explained like his stance or whatever, and she'd have been like, "The only person I know that uses this stance is is John." <laughs> is John? <laughs> oh yes. What's it called? I was thinking, the way I see it is if it wasn't going to happen, now it was going to happen like right after the battle. At yeah. this point, um, with the Royals, because the Royals got bodied, right? Yeah. At this point, they had like no other option. Um, again, the only reason they're having this war in the first place is because John's messing up their stuff. That's the only reason they're like taking all these measures. So I think that would have been the last measure. I mean, after the battle, maybe two or three days, three days later, they just have all the roles run up to Seraphine and be like, yo, John's Joker. Like, can, can you, he's your man. Can what? Can... No, wait. So wait, this this just popped in my mind. So the, we all know about the, the principal. I can never remember, remember his name. Is it Vaughn? I say Vaughn. He, he's up to, he up to something. He, he, he is, but he's I, I feel, I feel, I feel like he, I feel like it maybe had it gotten too out of hand. He would have, he would have finally left his office and be like, listen, Seraphina. Uh, let me let me let me uh, let me drop some knowledge on you, and she ain't gonna refute what he says. He's the headmaster. He got it. He knows everything. <laughs> no, no, that's not how I. That's not how I see it. No, that how it works. That how it's gonna work. <laughs> oh no, forget that. All right, so I'm man Vaught, right? It turns out Vaught is like busted, and or he has like some goons come up, right? And they pull some like SWAT level foolishness. <laughs> SWAT like, level foolishness. True. <laughs> And then, and then just change on, and then uh, Vaughn's just like, all right, I guess I have stuff in now. And then he unmasks it in front of like her. He's yeah. watching and I pull, in like, front of everybody. Exactly. Do you know how crazy that would be? I'd lose my mind. Oh, Yo, my I, I, I would, I would be done with this series for a little bit, just trying to collect my dots about how everything Man. that just transpired. <laughs> I wanted it, bro. I really did. <laughs> I really did. Like the, the weeks, the weeks leading up to the season finale, I was, I was like, yo, this mess better go nuclear or something. Like, I need to see some, I need to see some buildings blow up or some foolishness because I, I know I needed that. I wanted it so bad. Yeah. And then but... it didn't happen, and I'm like, you know what? Next season. <laughs> <laughs> Next nah. season. We gonna get some with him, but no oh. jump. Jumping back to the relationship, so like I said, I feel like ro- worst case scenario they understand, but you know no communication. But I feel like as when we start off with the series, I don't like I said I don't know how she's going to confront him about it, but let's just skip that part because there's multiple ways that can go down. But I, I guarantee you that for the most for the most part of this series, for the most part of this season, John and Serafina are going to be on a no communication basis and. If she sees him, she's probably going to run. But I also feel like the other worst case scenario is John might feel like Serafina betrayed him. Not like in the sense like he she uh, pl- applauded here we against go. him. <laughs> not in, like I said, not in the sense that she feels like, like he feels like she plotted against him. But, you know, his whole thing is period, point blank. He did this for her. He did this for her. Did he really, though? It, it, it's 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 like, debatable, it. but I probably go like sixty forty that it was for her, sixty on her side. I'm, I'm, I would say 80, 20, 20, 20, 20. on her side. <laughs> <laughs> no, like shame it. Actually, explain your reasoning real quick because it's oh, probably might be the same as mine. Mm-hmm. All right, bless. So again, he started this foolishness, right? Well, he like his he was just tired of getting pushed around. 
that's like that was the base thing and then all of a sudden sarah came back and that fool said oh yay i have like a reason to live and then she got gooned up and that fool said oh even more reason so i think her reason like the reason she's a cripple i think it's just icing on the cake mm -hmm. so, and like everything else every, and then the cake itself is just like the um just like all of the bad stuff that he's seen all the bad stuff that he's done the the turf war incident all that other stuff that's just been that's just been building up for years that's the thing i agree with i i, I can agree with that i can agree with that but but for the most part like i said he could feel like like oh like you're gonna do me like that i thought we were cool and he and, he, and it could it could either like we don't we knew he was a bad a bad ruler at new boston we know that we i don't think we really know exactly how bad he was because he I, i'm either saying he's gonna go back to that or he's gonna get a lot worse because now he's Man, we don't know anything about new boston dude. we we don't <laughs> Not a dang thing. so i'm just saying like if he if he thinks that like if this goes in the way where he he feels betrayed or any type of way and he just goes like ham again that's when i feel like uh Vought is gonna be like okay listen here son you, you're doing a little too much for my taste right now I get, here we go again <laughs> like i got keon and them down my throat uh i don't need anything else right now <laughs> Yeah, I can see that happening. I can see that happening very soon. I can see that happening very soon. Right, right. Like you said, right? So next season, we're going into next season, right? Yeah. Um, Let's say a couple of days pass, and then Sarah Sarah is just like acting really shady for like those couple of days. And so finally, he's like, yo, what's wrong with you? And then she just drops like a bunch of very vague but correlating questions, and then finally drops like, yo, I know you're him. Why did you do all this foolishness? And then they get into like this nuclear fallout of relationship. <laughs> and then because she was like his life like he's just gonna start <laughs> just body <laughs> indiscriminately and then yeah. Vaughn's gonna be like well now I have to step in <laughs> I don't feel like she's gonna say he saw it like I saw it why do you lie to me yeah do you, do you think John would ever lay hands on Serafina heck no <laughs> I don't either <laughs> I hope not I'm really hoping if he does I'm I might be done no I, unless he forces Unless he forced he would have himself to, like, to go berserk. Yeah, he would have to go like that shit crazy. He'd have to like he'd have to be seeing red. Every everybody would have to be labeled as a target. That's gonna make it like, eliminate. <laughs> it's a straight Terminator you know, kill mode. I was just about to say that on Terminator shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh lord. Oh man. But like no, if he's going to ha if he has like any sentience, then he's not going to harm Seraphina. I, I, that'd be the one thing I would never forgive, like at all. I'll never forgive you. <laughs> I, I'm like, you don't put your hands on your girl like that. Well, that's the thing, though. He's not his girl anymore. <laughs> Facts. Ooh. Ooh, bro. Like, I'm telling you, when I saw that scene with like her, like all the memories of them shattering, my heart broke a little bit. I was like, no. <laughs> I, bro, I I know I know you were hurt. I I knew you were hurt. Like I know, like I like I always sh I like I know I play around and I ship Cecile and uh, John, but now now I ship Cecile with Arlo. But still, I I do ship John and Serafina like Hello? hard. Shipping There's no way. <laughs> shipping video is coming. Oh, the shipping video is coming. Shipping video is coming. Oh, yeah. I'm about to be on that. I got the tier <laughs> list and everything. It's going. This is going to be some goofiness. <laughs> oh no. I just want to see somebody cringe. I'm gonna That's knock the goop. I'm gonna knock the goofy out of somebody ass with that video. <laughs> Not the goop. Mm. That's facts. <laughs> Bizarre. Za wardo. But, uh, but like, yeah. Um, I don't think their their relationship is going to be. Is good. It's not gonna be okay. No, it's not gonna yeah, be okay. Not gonna be but at the end, the at the time. end, do you think it's gonna recover, or do you think it's just gonna be like, look? We're cool. Possibly, We're cool, but we can't. We can't think, talk anymore. Like, I think something that shit insane will happen, or something like so bizarre that they have to trust each other again. Or yeah, like, I feel like they can because t I was thinking about this earlier at work today. Now, y'all can correct me if I'm wrong, but is it their situations are kind of the same? Both of them have been wronged by society. Serafina had the better life because, you know, she's she's God tier and her parents and all that got money from what we can tell. But society still pushed her and 
this way that she just was not okay with. Everybody was a yes man to her. Anyone that tried to talk to her was either trying to get to her probably for her money or because of, you, know, you know, how strong she is. John was the only person that, you know, until she found out what happened, uh, that was like, like he said, this, this, he likes me for me. Just not, not because I'm Serafina the ace, but because I'm just Serafina. And in John's case, a normal yeah, normal human being. But in John's case, you know, he, he was, he was labeled a cripple. He was really just a late bloomer. And then when he did what society told him to do, which, which was climb the ranks and assume your rightful place in the status quo. And when he, and the, but they didn't approve of the way it, they did it. So they shunned him for it. You see what yep. I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. That's nice. So I feel like I feel like if they can communicate, that's the thing. That's the key with the look. lack of communication is a major problem in the yeah. series. So like kids, I don't know. Like I know Ty is of age uh, and all that, but if y'all don't know anything about me, no, I'm 26. I'm engaged. Communication Ooh, is okay. is everything. I've been. Okay. You, me and my fiance are high school sweethearts. We've been together for ten plus years. Good. Mm. Yo, we got, we got clap it up. <laughs> Yo, get the bells, man. <laughs> but if y'all don't, if, if anything, this just proves that communication is key. It it, it probably would have hurt her. It, she would have been hurt about this period point blank, no matter what time and period that he brought this up, unless he just came straight out at, at when they first met. Like, hey, uh, I can, I'm, I'm, I'm op. And she's like, okay, that's fine. I'm OP too. We're just going to be OP together. But <laughs> had he brought this up earlier. Now, it, now it, that he like, you know, did all this stuff behind her back when he could just told her the first then I feel like all this could have been avoided. And you, funny, you, you, you guys know I'm like the one that be like, you know, some of this stuff could have been avoided <laughs> if you just done this and this. Like, you know. This like all could have been good if like he he really could have just told them when his dad was there, because yeah. I mean his dad like opened up the door. That's cool, but he, uh, he was saying some really sus stuff. No, he was. He he asked who was stronger. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, that should have been like a key. Like that, that was a red flag for real. Red flag. <laughs> that was the big red flag right there. So. Right. Do, we 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 all know that Seraphine has mostly heard about the fact that John's lied to her. But do you think do you think uh, seeing him body like her so called friends would ha will have an effect on the relationship too? Or do you think she doesn't really care about that? <laughs> well, probably just Remy at most. Yeah, the fact that he bodied Remy is gonna like be like oh that come would on, man. probably like destroyed it. Mm -hmm. And then Elaine might snitch and be like, oh yeah, he slapped me once. <laughs> <laughs> Bitch, I live here. <laughs> oh, I still remember the episode. Oh, gosh, man. Uh, snap. So, and then, yeah, with all of that, like, and then she'll, and she'll, she, yeah, she'll definitely go to the royals. She'll go to the royals first to be like, yo, what the heck's going on? And then what because royals? they're already bodied, <laughs> oh well, the former royals, and since they're already bodied and like really salty that they lost, they're gonna spill everything to her. I feel like Arlo is going to be like. If anybody Arlo is probably salty about it, Remy knew this was going to happen at some yeah. point. I mean, even after that conversation, she knew, like, it's already over. No, nope, like, I feel like Arlo is going to yell and be like, I fucking told you. <laughs> yeah. No, he's going to take it. Arlo's going to be Eisen's going to be salty because he got the worst of it, dude. Like, this man's got the body, like, what, five times by John, dude? All deserved. Dude. All of it deserved though. But but all I'm not gonna stunt though. Our, Eisen was the only one. Like all of them were scared of jo of Joker. But Eisen like re legitly like was like scared of this man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. um, I mean he. I mean he broke the man's jaw. <laughs> he did. He burned he him to Chris, back. and we all had that served to us. That's facts. No, <laughs> like. like <laughs> The worst one is still is just like he he threw that punch and John just caught it. it was like what are you doing and just shot the beam I was like that is cold that's cold <laughs> he like just, he was like yeah damn like can you just and imagine you threw his arm through like your whole like your whole yeah. forearm just got a hole blasted through it <laughs> clean through there's nothing there not even yeah. a skeleton bee bro I I don't think Isaac's gonna be one of the ones that recover. 
No, I think like, I, I think Ice is gonna be like, I'm done with all of you. Leave me alone. <laughs> like the way this man just freaking body he, this good man. He got I'm fr- just like <laughs> he got fricasseed and everything, dude. It was crazy. Yeah. He went by his was was gonna... bizarre. Isaac is going to be like a like a little baby for like I I I promise you he's gonna be whining like no please don't I don't want to deal with you guys anymore he <laughs> scares me. I'm gonna, feel- I'm gonna say this now the school is gonna be in mass chaos I can say it, I can tell oh, yeah. you that yeah it's gonna be it, I wouldn't I wouldn't doubt if it's in chaos for like for like half of the season two like to be real I don't think it's going to start in chaos though because these people are like yo what's going on or like what's happening so it's I think it's just more questions. Mm. And with the Rose being gone, but give it about two or three weeks. And then with the Rose being gone, and they're going to be like, well, I can do whatever I want now. I think the, the mid tiers are going to start lashing out, and then it's just going to, yeah, and that's how it's going to start. Yeah. So I'm over here just like, like, this is, I call it the bad ending, quote unquote. Like, again, this could have been for if I didn't just, you know, legit say something. Oh, this is the bad this, wait this season this season finale was a bad ending for you There's like no quote, quote quote unquote <laughs> like for the main character at least things could have been much worse no i this mean like, like no <laughs> like when i say bad ending i mean like if you play persona you know like the holy grail spoiler alert if you accept that offer you get the quote unquote bad ending and i'm mm. over here thinking like an ordinary like John could like you know done some different things like planned this out a little bit better. That's why I said this is quote unquote bad ending. John because gets recruited for Ember. I'm calling it. But I'll say there, John's every friendship is broken. That's why I call it a bad ending. That's fine. Yeah. I would say it's the the true ending would be like okay, I understand where you're coming from with this, but why you do it and there still be friends again like. Or he could just told her the first time, or could have got the good ending where it just like, okay, cool. Like Arlo did this and that to me. Okay, cool. Beat his ass. <laughs> yeah. Like, Do you, I, I, <laughs> I divide stuff into endings. I, you, you know, did y'all notice how like, uh, close Evie and Seraphine were getting before this whole ordeal happened? I feel like yeah. I feel like Evie is going to be in the forefront more, and this is this, this is me grasping for straws. Like, really, I don't know. I don't know if this will happen. But can do you think Evie might get like more confident, and maybe her ability might get stronger, even though it's only it, like light up hands? More. I think it'll get more. I think it'll get stronger. Yes. Whether whether it whether her ability. I know. I think she's gonna get more confident. Whether her ability will get stronger, I don't have to depend on. Again. The, the scrapping that's about to get out go on this school and all the other foolishness but i think like her and it's not gonna be just evie it's gonna be like her entire squad yeah with seraphina yeah her entire squad's gonna like get like a little i think they're going to focus on that entire like I, i'm this is what i'm theorizing after um the whole john and sarah fallout she is going to go with her um with her new best friends and um kind of just mess with them and then kind of teach them the ropes of both give, give them like life lessons and uh fighting lessons and all other stuff and they're going to become more and more confident and start scrapping with people and they're probably and who knows they might well when at when the mid tiers start acting out they might be the f- first of the low tiers to kind of just you know clap back and mm-hmm. uh, <clears throat> yeah <laughs> do you... might, but that like that's that's an even that's an even shorter straw to grasp at yeah do you... i kind of oh, my fault like I kind of see their abilities just straight up growing within the time. I'm like remember they're all like low tier, so when they jump up to mid tier in the time, the first season and then to the second season, because we're not sure how far the time skip will actually be, or if there is a time skip. I was wondering I about that. I don't. I don't think there's gonna be a time skip. I think it kind of be weird to have a time skip right now. I think it'd be like one month later or something like that. Well, I'd be fine with that as long as it's nothing like too drastic or anything. No, for, no. For I, I would even had them question it. For me, if they're going to have a time skip, they have to have a, they have to have a reason. And if the reason was, oh, the royals are recovering, and this is what was happening in the school after, uh, while the royals were recovering, then that that could be. I could work with that time skip, but I don't see it being a month. I would say probably two and a half weeks, possibly. Mm-hmm. <sighs> yeah. 
I see that. D- so, so, if if Serafina does, you know, go the route and she starts training the low tiers, do you think that is going to put like a? Because you know she she, as we know, when or they're when they're kids before they get their abilities, they do uh, combat training. But once they get them, that kind of just goes out the window. But Serafina did train with Jean for a little bit, and it it worked. She's a proficient fighter now, but it do you think? Hands. Yeah. But do you think that just gonna make her like more mad? She's like, I'm teaching them how to fight, but I'm teaching them the same fighting style that this that person. That this dude taught yeah. me. <laughs> it's it's just crazy, man. True. Like, I, I guess I'm with stuff on. I'm with stuff. If he was here on this one, I, I'm just I'm just waiting for the nuclear. He just stuff. sleep pops up. <laughs> yeah, it starts roasting everybody. It's exactly. I'm just waiting for the nuclear destruction, bro. Like that's that's all I'm waiting for. Oh, I know like, it's gonna it's gonna I'm, happen. I'm I have I'm no so doubt. Intrigued with the next with like the next tier threat. Like I'm so intrigued, and I kind of just like want that to happen already. But I'm open to again. We were taking her time and clear cleaning up everything else that we have to do in Wellston. But I think that next like that next level threat is going to be what's going to have to bring them together i feel because, like, like if, yeah I'm a, I was it's like, the I, same thing with humans if um if a i'll give you a um if a if a human person or like if people are going to fight amongst themselves unless they have a bigger stuff they have to deal with yeah they're gonna fight amongst themselves <laughs> yeah, they're gonna, gonna happen. do that so i th- so th- there's another video topic i want to do who who we're not gonna. We're gonna try not to go too deep into it, because uh, this video is probably about to end in a minute. But I'm really wondering, like, who who who's gonna be that threat that actually is able to not only go toe to toe with John, but actually put him on his ass. <laughs> um. Let's see. We got Ember, Earl Chan. They say they're gonna be introducing a new character. Oh, it might be a new character. Like. There's so many possibilities. I kind of hope it's either someone from Ember or it's someone from another high school that that we just didn't know, but who just came from like left field. It's like you like yeah, y'all thought y'all was sweet out here. Like nah, bro, we got the smoke over here at the, at Ogwen or some other high school that gets named. <laughs> I, I need to see more Ogwen. I need to see more Ogwen. Oh, <laughs> uh, in all honesty, yeah. I, I, I want I want Spider Chick back. That's fine, bro. Yeah, let's see. Uh, let's say that Ogwen, while while Wellston is going through this like breakdown of the student body, Ogwen is going over here doing more turf wars with like other other like rival schools and stuff like that. They they've been in the lab, and then and then let's say that they have some stinking grand sports festival like thing, and they just roll up and it's like yo, so we're busted now. Oh yo yo yo! What if um what if Ogwen? Because apparently, oh, what if Ogwen has like goons from New Boston? Because um, we, New Boston, like that'd be school. crazy, but we don't know yet. Exactly, like I, that's just that's like in some more theory like territory. Some goons from New Boston ran up in Ogwen, and they were like their new uh, busted people, and they go against Wellston, who was like in shambles, and just clap all of them. Because <laughs> I'm kind of thinking right now. Because remember, Earl posted that picture of New Boston when they won the first win. Yeah. What could, that could be hinting something, possibly. I feel. I, you know, why ain't she do it now? Until why? Why she did it now? Why ain't, she, ain't do it during the season? Like it's it's it throwing me off a little bit. I might be thinking too much. Is that coincidence? I think. Not. I think not. <laughs> I think not. I feel like the story is gonna be a little bit more polished uh, this time around because I I hope she's take I hope she's like actually getting aggressive and actually thinking about like the main you know plot point or wherever she's trying ha- however she wants to end this I don't know uh, and all that. It's gonna get darker, that's for sure. <laughs> I hope so. Like, dude, it's gonna get hella I just, darker. I just bought like a, a a new manga, boy. This thing is dark, and I love it. Just it's just, ooh, I'm a, I'm gonna make a rev- I'm making a review video about it, so y'all see it, y'all uh y'all will see it. Some in you the know coming I'm gonna weeks. question. What's up? You got a question? Or you got a question? No, you know I'm gonna question it. It's oh, called well. it's called torture, princess. Hmm. <laughs> Excuse me. Stop, Kamusai. Um, 
Take that what you will. It's called torture, princess. Um, Be on the lookout. I'm 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 gonna have to um call the um FBI if it's what I think it is. <laughs> but all right, this video is gone for a minute. I hope I hope everyone enjoyed this. I uh I appreciate Steph. No, I don't say Steph. Steph ain't even here. Oh, damn it. Oh my lord! Oh, get my Nan's name right. I know. Oh. I appreciate uh Super Sky Shaman and my and my boy Ty coming out for this video. Um, tell them where they can find y'all at. Looks like those. Um, you can go first, Ty. Um, what was the question? It kind of blacked out on me. <laughs> tell the, <laughs> tell the these lovely people where they can find you at. <laughs> you guys already know. Go to my channel, Ty and Mason Three Twenty One, or I'm just gonna have Fox put a link to my channel in the description below. Oh yeah, the links but, will um, will be there. Um, yeah, so but, um, thank you for having me, bro, and peace. Um, you can find me at uh, Super Sky Shaman, the channel <laughs> on YouTube. Um, but if you guys really want to mess with me, uh, I have a Discord. You can uh, join that through any of my channel videos. I post a lot of cool stuff in there. Um, a lot Pokemon of like, life facts and that Pokemon content. What's it called? We talk about everything, okay? Just chatting, you know what I'm saying? Everything you got a topic, leave it to me, and then I got you. But yeah, that's that's it for me again. Thanks for having me on here, Fox. Hope yeah. to be on here again, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, yep, y'all. Uh, everyone watching this video, if you made it to the end, please go subscribe to these uh, these wonderful gentlemen. Uh, I will be doing more videos with them in the future. Also, do remember that I have a Discord, uh, it's always down in the uh, description. Also, if you want to uh, get some cool uh, merch, go to kawaiiwaru.com. Use your, use your, uh, my code kawaiifox, get yourself 10% off. And you know, with all that, I hope you have a lovely day. And it's your boy Fox. Out.